When am I going to remove all that stuff on YouTube about you? Hmm, and all the defamatory stuff you put on there about people. What's that, Frank? Well, you listen to it, you put it on there. Isn't it true? No, it's not true. And you know Which it's part not. isn't true, Frank? Everything that comes out of your mouth. Oh, really? Yeah. So Channel 40 is a truck driver's channel, is it? It's still existing. Channel 40 has never been a truck driver's channel. Just grab your license plate because I'm going to report you, Frank. For what? You know, you've been harassing me since that day at court. Oh, and, where um, have I been harassing you? On Citizens Band Radio. I've got the recordings, Frank. And, you got uh, me on Citizens Band Radio? Yes. Harassing you? Yes. I don't even own a Citizens Band Radio. Yeah, well, I'm afraid that, you know, your, uh, your friends do own a Citizens Band Radio. Now, do, do you own a Citizens Band Radio? Well, where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, Oh wow, look at this. Jeez, unreal. Look at this. Oh. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Just wait there a minute, Frank. Just wait a minute, alright? Yeah, I'll be back in a sec. Alright, Frank. Now, there are no truck channels on CB Radio. There's what? There are no truck channels on CB Radio, Frank. Alright, and we're having a lot of problems with people invading Citizens Band Radio. None of us can use it for our own reasons, and we're CB Radio hobbyists. And uh, all I hear on there day in, day out is my address and my name and defamatory remarks. About you? Yes. Well, what about the defamatory remarks that you make? about people. You made the um, I have recordings for every single time well, I've... what you've said about me. Well, I've got recordings of every single no, time no, I've been no, on no, CB... No, no, Frank, no, no. let me finish my sentence. Go on. From the beginning of when we've been on CB radio, I've been recording it. Now, at first, for years, we just ignored it. But um, soon after that, we started uh, hearing our addresses. The taunts went something along the nature of, we're going to track you down, give out your address, and then we're going to home invade you, kill you, burn your house down, now, I've got recording equipment in there recording today, and it's just endless. We've only just got home. I've only just been man managed to record, uh, I mean, review a bit of the recording. And in the first five minutes of listening to it, we hear it. My address, um, death threats. But you're threatening. I'm being threatened. No, 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 no. I'm being threatened. Yeah, but I've heard your recordings. Look, I've been threatened for you years, you're Frank. You're the guys working on the Super Express. Frank, I've you're been threatened, threatened for threatened. years. But why did you threaten me? Why did you threaten me? Where did I threaten you? I don't initiate these things. Where did I threaten you? Look, Frank, I've got over 20 years of recordings showing that I don't initiate any of the threats. I've only responded to threats. Well, where have I threatened you? Well, I, in my recordings... Where it, have I threatened you? It, let me finish. In my recordings, you come on the CB radio... Me? Frank, yes, you come on the me? CB... Yes, you, Frank. How do you know it's me? Because it's your voice. It's my voice. Look, WaveLab is like a voice print. It's like a fingerprint. You can change your voice if you want. You could suck helium. Your larynx are the same length. I mean, I don't know how it works exactly by biometric recognition. How do you know it's me? Because it's your voice, Frank. It, it matches mean? your recordings. My recordings? It matches the recordings of you on television. It's the same voice, Frank. You're deluded. I don't get on CB radio. Listen. I don't get on CB radio. It's, it's you. I don't have to get on CB radio It's you, like taunting, you, it's you taunting me. Right. No, it's because you've and been taunting other No, people. no, Frank. You taunt, My, you threat. All right, Frank, look, I've got recordings of every time I've been on CB radio to back me up with time and date. Have the authorities come here and questioned you? Over what? Over what you do on CB on the CB radio network. Have you been questioned by any of the federal authorities? Why would, why would they want to question me, Frank? I've got the recordings of it. They would just have to press play and go, oh, okay, so this has all been incited. 
giving out people's addresses. Look, this is a death threat, Frank. But you you listen, to listen. No, no. I, how, can I, how can I death threaten them, Frank? Because no, no, I can't no. identify them. No, but people have how heard can you. I death threaten them? I can't identify them, Frank. People have heard you give out addresses of police officers. Police officers? Yeah. You're denying that? What? How would I be able to identify anybody, no, no, Frank? You, you give them the names of where they live. <laughs> you are delusional. How can I identify police officers? Have you ever tried to look one up on an electoral roll? Name suppressed. Right. Right, so how could I possibly be able to find the police officer? Frank, stop well, talking somehow, crap. Listen, you found on, the, on the years that I've been on CB radio, I've recorded every incident. I have the full recordings with today's headlines for every single event I've been on CB radio, so you can't argue with the physical evidence. This is done on that day, and when you look at the recording, you can see that. Now, I have never even engaged with any of these people harassing me, it had been going on for years, I'd been ignoring it, didn't even respond. Their insults are quite frankly brain dead, so there's no point in responding. That got them so angry, they started on the, I'll track you down and give out your address to try and get a, a rise out of me. So you're saying you, you've, and been that's CB, how it goes. You've, you've been on CB radio all these years, you haven't threatened anybody, You've actually behaved yourself. I've responded, I've heard you. I've heard you. Frank. I've responded to threats. Yeah. Frank. I've responded to threats, and the precedent, the you precedent for language is set by other people. Yeah, but it's not threats. You're responding. No, no. When they're so when they're you. identifying me and my address, and then saying they're going to come here and kill me, that's a death threat, Frank. It's I can't it's identify it's these people. How can I threaten them? I'm I'm just talking about you. You're general, crazy. I'm talking about your general demeanour. On CB radio. Yeah, I talk to my friends, of course. No, no, I talk to my. I talk to my friends on there, Frank, and I don't talk to anyone I can't identify. Everyone that hears you. Well, why are they attacking me for, Frank, if they don't want to do that? They don't like what you're doing. I'm talking to my friends. Why don't they go away? We don't start conversations with people we don't know, Frank. In the, all the years I've been on recording and I've been, I've been on CB and recording it, I have never once started an argument with somebody. Why would I want to just start disturbing the shit for no reason? I've got friends to talk to on there. I don't need to do that. Yeah, but you abuse other people. Not one of these people. Not, people, one of these, not one of these people mm -hmm. can identify themselves. They don't have call signs. Now, the ACMA guidelines clearly state that you should be able to identify yourself on CB radio. Some of these people can't get through because you dominate the airway. How can I? I've only got a five-watt radio. Have you? Absolutely. Well, there are people that have... It's a Uniden, OH77. Right. What's that? Well, That's people, a five-watt radio, Frank. You've got more power than what you're. I know how to set my. You drown them out. I know how to set my equipment up, and I'm in a building. This is always going to get over a mobile unit. Have you threatened a uh, an amateur radio club or members? I've got recordings of an amateur radio club sitting on their front porch, threatening me and giving out my address from a person's cell phone that was that was in attendance have that you recorded it. Them? You've threatened. How could I identify them? How can I identify no, them, no, Frank? You've threatened them. How can I identify them to threaten them, Frank? Well, you've just How can I identify them to threaten you've them? You just told me, you just admitted to me that they've threatened you. Yeah, exactly. So you know all about them. But how can I identify them, Frank? I don't know who they are. But you've got on... How, Frank, how already. can I threaten someone I don't know who they are? Why? Listen, the threats go like this. One to Book Avenue, Kilburn, come around and kill you. And I've got recordings of your friend Peter Cordicott also winding me up the morning after the, the um, home invasion, calling be? me hammerhead and all sorts of weird why stuff. Why would he do that? Frank, he did it. I've got the recordings. It went to air the next why day. Would you, why would you post stuff on radio about me being a pedophile, that you're going to kill me? You're well, gonna do that. listen. Why would you... Listen, why, Frank, what have who, I, did you, who did you um, stick up for in court? Who was the person that you were defending? There's a person that you accused of being a pedophile. I that is know. a person that has threatened my yeah. friends, has threatened me, has followed my friend's children around yeah, to the school. I've heard what you've listen, said listen, he you followed my friend. No, 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 he, what, what happened first was he followed my friend's children to school and then he gets on the radio telling everybody, this is Kay's daughter, this is what she's wearing today, I'm going to kill her and rape her. Do you want the recording of when he was living next to the polking horns? Do you want that recording, Frank, of what he did with their children? Have you got that on uh, YouTube? Do you put it on YouTube? I wouldn't put that on YouTube. But why do you put all that garbage on YouTube? It's real. It really happens on the radio because that's what's happening to me, Frank. So that's why I'm putting it on YouTube. What, what? do you want to do this stuff to me and get away with it? No. Do what to you, though? Threaten me and hassle me. You come out, I, I come out of freaking court and you're telling people that I've had a restraining order put against me. Well, I was know. successful putting one against him that day. There, there was a joint restraining order. But what about your previous criminal history? 
Well, my previous criminal history, history that you mentioned yeah. resulted from a person stealing a key to my house and then ringing me up and telling me to come and get it. When I arrived, they attacked me, Frank. That particular a, day, I was the one that came out worse off, Frank, because a, I was attacked by them. But you've got a them. previous criminal history for violent behaviour. Well, then don't, well, no, well, don't hassle me. And then, that, you know what I mean? Like, and then I won't have to I retaliate, know. Frank, and then things don't you're happen. You're saying post lies. I'm not posting I'm, lies, well, Frank. Well, what, the what, person what? that you're defending, I've got... No, no, no I'm, I'm now defending myself. The person that you were... The defend person myself. that you were defending in court, Frank, he can't... He why, why shouldn't I come here and sue the pants off you for what you've said about me? Sue the pants off me for what? Because it's true, well, Frank. I'm a pedophile. Is that what I'm saying about you? Well, you said it! I said you defended a pedophile, Frank. There's no, a big difference. No, no, you called me one. Where okay. is that, Frank? I've got the recording. Okay. I thought you weren't on CB Radio, Frank. I wasn't. It was given to me by people who can't stand you on CB Radio. And what was their last name? Does it start with a Z? I don't have to tell you what their last name yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, well, because anyway, one, one handful you know, of you know, people, Frank, that you're hanging out with, and we've got the recordings of them harassing these these neighbours' children, their, what, our what, friends' children. What intrigues, then there is what, our group on CB Radio, a large group of people with call signs, Frank, that can be identified. What intrigues me is... Why are you totally obsessed with CB Radio? Because my friends are on there, Frank. My friends are on there. We've got call signs. We talk to each other. Is this you got a, have you got a CB on you? I'll put a call out and you watch. I've got, I've got friends on there that have call signs that will respond that we can identify, Frank. Why can't your party ever be identified? Can you, can you explain that? Why don't you have call signs? Why don't you I use call signs? CB radio. No, the people that you're defending, the you. people that you're defending, why don't they have call signs? I don't need to play Frank, why can't silly the people that you're... You are playing a silly game. Frank, the people that you're defending, why don't they have call signs? Can you explain that to me? Frank, I don't know. Why can't that. they be identified? Why do they revel in their anonymity? Why do, they, why do they revel in the fact that they can't be identified, Frank? What are they doing? Why can't they be identified, Frank? We have no problems identifying ourselves, Frank. They can't be identified. Why is that, Frank? What are they up to? Trolls, starting trouble, yeah? That's the only reason they're there. You're we talk, we... You know the CB troll? We talk to each other. We talk to only we stations talk with... Shit. We talk... Excuse me? We talk to stations we with talk. We talk shit. Frank, say, I've heard what you said. We talk to each other. Crap. Frank, you, I don't care what you think the content of our conversations are, Frank. Is, your content is... Frank, now you're off the CB. Real. Now you're doing it here in real life. I am doing it in real life. Now you're, you're off the CB and you're you, doing the very thing in real you life. You listen. Me. Listen, Frank, you offend me. Look, you offend me. You can't be identified. Your crew can't be identified on CB radio. There's a reason for that, Frank. We don't use CB. Do you use CB radio, boys? The people... Of course you do. How do you get from job to job, you liar? Listen, yeah, the people you that you hang out with... The people that you yeah, hang out with... Yeah, from job, for what? What? You reckon we've got a CB radio? Oh, no, of course. No, you don't use got, scanners. What you've got? No, we don't use scanners. No. Or well, how the hell do you get from one job to the other? How? What? You think we rely on CB radio like you? Like it... Your, your little toy that put in your car. I mean, you behave like a kid. You actually... Frank, you're it. the one standing here arguing with me about my hobby and you're saying I act well, like a kid. Your, your hobby... Look, you turned your hobby... Listen, I've got, I've got, another, into, I've got one more question. More question. I've got one more question for you. It's not an obsession, it's my friends. It's like talking to someone on Skype. Do you do anything saying, else for your work? Frank, do you, you know, I'm looking at your Twitter feeds. Yeah. And apart from I enjoy them, do you? You know, I, I enjoy the fact that you barrack for Juventus and AC Milan. That's interesting. I, but, don't, um, ba I don't barrack for Juventus. I barrack for Adelaide City Juventus. Oh, OK. Right. And AC Milan. And, and AC right. Milan. And okay. Manchester United. What about you? Uh, Liverpool for me. And uh, Juve, yes. OK. Yeah. Well, but, um, right, so do I follow you? Um, I don't have a Twitter account. I just look you at your Twitter. Okay. I don't follow you. I don't have a Twitter account. I was just right. looking at what you were saying on there. And what was I saying? Yeah, you're pretty defamatory yourself, Frank. Of? You've got some radical outspoken views, and you like no, to... No, they are my opinions. Well, these are my, my opinions, opinions aren't Frank. opinions are defamatory. <laughs> well, these are my opinions, Frank. Yeah, your opinions, the difference is your opinions... Uh, are my opinions, opinions are only defamatory to be... towards people that are hassling me, Frank. If you, wanna, if you wanted to use your hobby in a more respectable manner... And how would I do that? Wouldn't... Frank, I am being <laughs> held... You don't they abuse. swear on there, Frank. The whole thing is nothing but swearing on there, Frank. Isn't there better things you could be doing stories on? You know, look, I mean, I, you know, I've seen the story that you did with that guy in the Royal Adelaide Hospital the other day. Right. What were you getting at there, Frank? We got him help. We did actually you? got him Did help. you get him help? Yeah, we did. 
Now, you're an investigative journalist, a reporter, apparently, right? Why don't you investigate my recordings? Can I send you my recordings for the whole history of when I've been on CB Radio? Then you can actually listen to... It has the headlines of the day for every single day that I've recorded, so you can't deny which day this is occurring on. The, the recordings are comp comprehensive, they're fully day-long recordings, and you can see where it all started, Frank. You can listen to it and have a look, and you can see that we've ignored it for years. It's only until I've started hearing my address, and isn't that incitement, giving out my address and telling people to come and kill me? Isn't that incitement? Well, that aside from the people who may have threatened you, there are people that haven't threatened you. I don't know, I can't identify them. I can't identify them, Frank. They don't have call signs. How can I possibly you're, be you're talking to them? You're obscene on air. You're, you know, you're I'm not obscene on air. I'm only using the same. The precedence is set by their dialogue. They start with the swearing. I'm just talking to my friends. They start swearing at me. I'm not even talking to them. I can't identify them. How often do you spend on it? Oh, quite a bit of time, Frank. Sure. Listen. Is there anything better to do? Yes, I do, and we're about to go do it. You're interrupting that. Okay, well, I'll let you go. Do you work? Have you ever worked in your life? Frank, everything in my life is none of your business. And how did you get those court documents out of the out of the uh, court? How did you get those documents out? Because your friend that you were um, defending published them on YouTube. Are you aware of that? How did he get his hands on it, Frank? Well, good luck to him. How did he get his hands good on it, Frank? Because Frank, how did he get his hands on it? Well, why don't you ask him? Why don't I've asked police. And what did the police do? They said that those, those documents are not available to the public. How did he get his hands on them is what they want to know. You can't just walk into a Sir Samuel Way building and request those documents. Yes, you can. And they'll give them to you. Yes, you can. Public oh, documents. That's not what they tell me. Who? The actual the, Who? The clerks of the court. That's, that's not what I've been told, public Frank. Public documents, okay? In your public document. I can get your, your record if I want. Why did you not get my entire criminal record? Because I can tell oh, you... There's more. What can, else have you done? I can tell you there's some more embarrassing stuff than that, Frank. What have you done? Why did you only take that one page? Did your daughter represent that fellow that day? Was that your daughter that represented him? Wrong. No, that no, wasn't her. No, she had a very oh, your niece. Hmm. Your niece represented him. So you got that wrong as well. So now you're you're saying why am I saying those things about you? But have you heard the recordings of what he did with the children on CB radio? What did he do? Well, he put his cameras on the side of their fence, okay, and then he recorded them at the pool. Then he tuned his AM radio so that he could come out on their walkabout analog phone. And then he started modulating on his radio into their phone telling him that he was going to rape them, that he was going to abuse them in several different ways. Police were involved. The, the next door neighbours, the Polking Horns, they tried to take him to court over it. They were unsuccessful. Now, do you want to really know what your friend's all about? Do you, you no, we have the recordings of him saying this. And you can look up, you said it's public record, you the Polking that. Horns, yes. Lisa and, um, well, I can get you their names, but Lisa Polking Horn for one, the mother of the children, mm -hmm. They eventually had to move out because his harassment wouldn't stop. Now, no one asked him to start harassing their kids. Nobody told him to do these things. These things happen through their own volition. These people's volition drives what they do. We don't ask them to do this, Frank. Now, these people that you are standing up for, I think you really need to have a listen I'm to what saying, they're all about. I'm just saying to you, why don't you tone down Listen, I'm talking... Language. Listen, why don't you tone down... Your style. Have, have you and me, have, have, have we been having a report at the moment that seems to be free of any kind of explicit things, Frank? It is. Well, I'm quite yeah, capable of talking for yeah, hours. You're threatening to punch me out like you did last time. I'm sorry about that. Listen, I, I, I can continue this in this fashion, speaking to anyone for any period of time, Frank. It's just that when I get threatened, when I get abused, when I get, um, you know, cussed out, so to speak, you give then the, the precedence is set. I give as good as I get, Frank. Yeah, that right. But why do you continue to do it all the time now? Why do they continue to incite me, Frank? Well, I don't engage with well, them in anything. Well, I can't well, identify well, them. Well, Frank, I can't get on there and identify them and start a discourse. It goes like this. Off. It goes like this, Frank. It goes like this. No, no, it goes like this, Frank. John Kiss, one to Brook Avenue killed them. Hmm. Pedophile, going to come around and kill you. Gonna, it starts with them identifying me and then them death threatening me, then them insinuating that I'm this or that. It doesn't start with me, Frank. I don't start them because I can't identify them. How what, can I start what, it? Why do you think they do that? What, what because I'm talking to my friends, and they've got no friends, Frank. They've got a CB radio in their vehicle. GME thought it was, you know, prudent to stick 600,000 CB radios in heavy and medium rigid vehicles, and now they think they own Citizens Band Radio. There is no exclusivity. Surely you've read the ACMA guidelines. I noticed the news no, story. No, no, no. There's no exclusivity, but you've made it exclusive to yourself. No. You don't they've it. made it exclusive to me by driving it on and on. John Kiss, one to, that's all I hear. Since your friend, Peter Caldicott, did that story on my house and released my address, that's all I'm hearing, Frank. 
and that is a death threat. With my address, saying they're going to come here and kill me, constitutes a death threat and incitement, Frank. What's happened on Channel 40 over the last few days? Well, I've got the recordings of it. What's happened? What do you mean, what's happened? Well, people have reported that there's nothing but a loud buzz. What's that? That loud buzz comes from just over here in uh, okay. Clearview. What is it? You know, it's no. someone playing the SBS um, uh, is it uh, feed to, stream. Somebody trying to block you up. Is it? Is it, it well, that goes on, if, as soon as I open my mouth on any channel, that starts up. They follow us around to every channel and do that. It's not exclusive to 40. They do it everywhere we go. Mm. But they, you, you've created this hostility. Obviously. No, I haven't. I've been talking to my friends, stations you can identify, and people with no call sign have been hassling us. That's how they can identify me. Why would I respond to someone that's saying something without my name in it? They could be saying it to anybody. But why did you put all this crap about people that you don't even know? Why would you put crap on there? Listen, it's not me? crap. They, it has well, the recordings. No, it I'm has rec recordings. It has recordings of you. It's actually criminally defamatory. Frank, it has recordings of you in it. It's not me, mate. You chose to ring my house at 3.20 in the morning on a Saturday and, and start harassing me on a cell phone. I've got the recording, Frank. It's up on YouTube. Are you kidding? Why would I want to ring you? I don't even have your number. The call came from just out here on Churchill Road. A uh, similar vehicle was seen. Oh, right. Yeah, that's the <laughs> car I drive. I don't know. I don't know, Frank, but a similar vehicle was seen. Hey, John, you don't get your facts right. You talk a lot of crap. Hey, it's Frank, you haven't got your facts right, and I've got the recordings. I have, mate. Hey, Frank, everything you're talking about, I've got recordings of. Yeah, but it's not me. Frank, every, Frank, every person you're sticking... Stop spinning around in circles. Listen, no, every, every, every single like person... Every single person that you're talking about, Frank, I have recordings of them death threatening me and giving out my friggin' address. I don't care about those people. Well, what about is this all about then? This, isn't this all about you trying to drive me off CB radio for you, at the whim of your uh, friend that likes to put cameras on his neighbour's no, fence? No, no. Well, else would be driving it along? You've, you've got a friendship. to be in the neighbourhood and thought, let's go and see if John kisses at home. You've got a, a niece, right? right? Angela Pangella, that um, represented this fella. There is a vested, there, there is a, between you guys, no, you say, there is um, uh, an agenda between you people. You obviously, why would she want to represent him for free? She's a lawyer. She does. Well, what does she, what does she wind she up with? legal aid. Listen. Well, who, who, who represents you? I've got, you? I've got. Is uh, that legal aid? No. You paid for it. Yes. Now, listen, Frank, um, you, your friend has been on the radio talking about how I should worry about where he got the court documents, who supplied the court documents, more or less putting you in it. And I've got the recordings of it, not you so much as, as um, your niece, but his friend you, in the man. media. His friend in the media is what he keeps talking about. Well, who's his friend in the media? You, obviously. Oh. Um, and that's, that's pretty much it in a nutshell. Now, unless you want me to supply you, and I'm quite happy to do it, I can supply you with the recordings of UHF in its entirety since it's been in existence. And I could, I could literally put together and highlight whatever sections you're interested in, lay it all out for you and give it to you. Well, you've, you've made accusations about me that I've called you at 3.20 in the morning. I wouldn't even waste my time calling you at 3.20 in the morning. Look, I have the recording. Well, you better give me a copy of it. I will. And what, what do I say in the recording? What do I say to you? Um, do you want, well, what, what do I say to you? To give you the recordings, so I'll just contact the uh, Channel 7 office. I'll gladly burn them off tonight and deliver them yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, please do. Absolutely will. I know what, I, what, what did I say to you at 3.20 in the morning? <laughs> well, uh, you, basically, you basically threatened me with court. and um, I threatened you with court? Well, this is what the recording has got in it. You're yeah. threatening me with court. And, um, what else? whole pile of, um, to tell you the truth, it sounds like you've taken too many end bones and you couldn't sleep. But, um, <laughs> look... <laughs> It, hey it, John, it, I'll give you the recording, hey, Frank. I'll give you the. Tell me something. I'll are give you, you the recording, you, and that's all I can do. Tell me something. Are you all there, Frank? Are you are all you, there? I am. Are you? You came at me you telling. Do you, do you no, no, wait. First, you're defending some guy. I'm just saying. Are you first, all you're defending there? some guy that's that's uh, known. I don't want to get known for for, for harassing his neighbour's kids. I'm not interested in that. I'm then you're coming out of. Then you're coming up to me in court, harassing me on the street for no reason. Frank, your mental makeup is just ridiculous. Look. You well, obviously have yours? Napoleon syndrome. That's one thing that you have. And the other What's Napoleon syndrome? Well, short man syndrome. Oh. But the other thing about you, Frank, is that um, I, I mean, I'm not that sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not oh, that God, sure. I'm this yeah, in well, family photo album. Napoleon syndrome. <laughs> he had a pretty good woman, didn't he? He did actually. Um, well, I wouldn't know. I wasn't there at the time. But 
Look, Joseph Bunyan. Yes. Um, let them eat cake. So... No, that wasn't him. That was Louis the Fourteenth. Histrionics lesson from Frank yeah, Pangello. Yeah. That's pretty good. Pretty good. All right. So, you've come up to me in the street. You've, um, my lawyer's said to you twice, look, we won't be giving you any comment, any, uh, well, luckily well, for you, you didn't I, listen to him, did I, you? I did, yes, I didn't listen to him, though, no. but you went off at him, you're going off at me on several occasions, Frank, where, now, I don't know if that's in your mannerisms or, you know, but you seem really <laughs> tensy, tensy, sort of, you know, I, I just don't like people putting lies, hey, I don't well, like I, people, I don't like I'm, people lying I'm, about me either, Frank, well, I'm, I'm just defending myself, all right, well, You've put lies on there about me. What have I put lies about you? You said that you haven't heard the recordings. I haven't. Well, well, no, I've heard the recordings that you've put on about me, but you've accused me of calling you at 3.20 in the morning. You've accused me of being on CB radio. Mate, I wouldn't even waste my time on CB radio. We know you get on CB radio. We have the recordings. Oh, right. Well, I want to hear those recordings, John. I'll, I'll burn you copies burn and I'll deliver them. I want to hear them. Fantastic. All right. Look, it's been interesting, Frank. It really has. Thank you. And um, Go on your way. You know, have a good day. But I'll supply you with the recordings, Frank. Take care. Oh,